Whoa! Oh my gosh! Can we get the rest of my body looking like that? Like my upper body? Hey everyone, thank you so much for clicking on today's video. For those of you who don't know, my name is Daniela and I'm on a journey to lose 100 pounds. I've lost over 60 pounds, all from the comfort of my home. So in today's video, we are switching gears on my weight loss journey. We are going back to the workout programs that have changed my life. I'm starting off today with four weeks of the prep. When I started this program, I was living in Toronto. However, ever since I moved from Toronto to Calgary, it kind of put a dent in that journey. And now that I'm settled here in Calgary, I want to jump back into that workout program because I love the results it gave me the first time around. Not to mention, I really, really, really want to work on my pull-up game. And this program lays the foundation to build that strength to get those pull-ups in. And Anyway, today we are kicking off with leg day, so let's get it done. Workout complete, and I'm now on a walk with the family at Fish Creek Provincial Park. Now, the end of that walk was brutal. It was a pure hill. Whew. However, we got in the steps. Tomorrow's a rest day, so I'll see you guys in two days. don't mind the appearance I literally just rolled out of bed the first thing I did was meditate rolled into my workout clothes and I did a journal entry I really want to make journaling consistent again because it really helps me to just connect with myself and keep out the external noise which is the purpose of this journey there are so many things constantly bombarding us on social media from our family and to our friends that you must be able to learn how to really really connect with yourself within because only you have the answers to your problems you truly do so trust in that inner self and trust in that higher self because it will guide you to places that you will never imagine I'm gonna get some coffee in and get to my workout. The workout on the menu today is endurance and agility. So it's basically a cardio workout. So let's get this done.
Now that was a good workout. 626 calories burned in 50 minutes. That is always a win. Honestly, when you put in the work today, you are setting yourself up for the future. Focus on the now. Do not focus on the end of the journey. Heck, there is no such thing as the end of the journey. When you hit your goal weight, go for another one. When you hit your fitness goals, create another one. We are always working towards something because progress is happiness. So I'm feeling great and now we are gonna go for a walk. Oh, it feels so good to be outdoors again. Let's walk this way. When I had my rest day, I stayed indoors because I wanted to avoid walking. But after today's endurance and agility workout, I need to loosen up these legs because they're filled with lactic acid. One of the benefits of being in Calgary is the endless sunlight. Like, yeah, we're, you know, tortured with a lot of snow. So the goal today is to get in my 10,000 steps. Ever since I've been very diligent with getting in my 10,000 steps, I've been noticing I am losing fat. Now I say fat instead of weight because I am not weighing myself. I have not weighed myself since before Christmas. But I say losing fat because I'm noticing I am getting loose skin on my tummy. It's not a lot of loose skin, but I'm noticing like little holes. Anyway, I'm going to enjoy this walk. It's the last day of 2020 and I'm putting in the work. I started this year working out hard and I'm going to end this year working out hard. My move from Toronto to Calgary did put a dent in my journey. It was a bit of a struggle, but now that I'm settled here in Calgary, I am back on track. 2021 is going to be the year of redemption. It's going to be a year I hit my goal weight. So for today's workout setup is a bit different. I have this guy over here. We are working on my pull-up game. That right there is a pull-up bar with a chin-up max. Now a chin-up max is a pull-up assist and I need it for today's workout. This is today's workout with my man Amala Caesar. This is the champion of Beachbody's six weeks of the work program right now i'm doing four weeks of the prep which is a prep to six weeks of the work which is one of beachbody's most difficult programs i love this program because it creates results i'm not afraid to do the hard i'm not afraid to put in the work and i'm going back to what works for me here's a non-scale victory for you guys i've never done this before so bear with me these shorts right here are loose as heck loose as heck now i haven't been on the scale since before christmas but as that quote says don't trust the scale trust your jeans well in this case trust my workout pants but holy holy smokes what are those i don't think i've ever seen my legs like whoa oh my gosh i never take pictures of behind me i think i should start i've never seen my shins like that like that is insane. Can we get the rest of my body looking like that? Like my upper body? Oh, we're not there yet, but we're getting there. And this program will definitely, definitely get me there. Wow. I don't think I've ever seen that in my life. 2020, we are going to make things happen tenfold. So this is my setup for today. I'm in the room. We got a set of light, medium, and heavy weights. Heavy weights are 20 pound dumbbells, so 40 pounds. Medium weights are 12 pound dumbbells, so 24 pounds. Light weights are seven pound dumbbells. And now, let's get into this program.
don't mind the laundry in the background. That is some real life-ish. Anyway, I enjoy starting a new workout program. When you start a new workout program, it's literally an opportunity to just refresh your journey. It's an opportunity to restart, refocus, realign, reset. And that is so important on any journey that is long and tedious, like a 100 pound weight loss journey. So I'm pretty stoked to jump back into four weeks of the prep. Now, four weeks of the prep is not a new program to me. This is my third time doing this program. When I first completed this program, I did it without the pull-up bar. My second time at doing this program, I ordered the pull-up bar because I really, really, really wanted to work on my pull-up game. Just like how I'm able to bust out these push-ups, I wanna be able to bust out these pull-ups. However, it's going to be an incremental process. It's gonna be a process where I focus on building strength day in and day out. It's not gonna happen overnight, just like how my push-up journey didn't happen overnight. But you bet I will get to pulling out those pull-ups because I'm so determined to do so. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, smash the like button, Hit that subscribe button as I'll be documenting my entire journey of four weeks of the prep and I'll be graduating to six weeks of the work. Four weeks of the prep is a prequel to six weeks of the work. And let me know in the comments below, have you ever done any of Beachbody's workout programs? If so, which one? I believe this is my 11th or 12th program. Anyway, see you guys on the other side.